Hi everybody, thank you so much for tuning in and welcome to the home of all things FIFA career mode. In this video I'm going to be looking at the best young central defensive midfielders in FIFA 22 and as with all my player recommendation videos they will be split into three categories, real faces, high potential and investments. Starting with the real face players, kicking off with Ofa Ball from Rangers. He can also play central midfield or centre back, 21 years of age, overall of 65, a potential of 77, a price of around 1.7 million. Matt Smith from Hull City is 21 years of age, overall of 67, a potential of 77, a price of around 2.2 million. Sadilek from PSV, who can also play as a left back, he's 22 years of age, overall of 72, a potential of 77, on loan in Season 1. Benigami from Hearts, he can also play as a central midfielder, 22 years of age, 69 overall, a potential of 78, a price of around 3 million. Ibrahim Diallo from Southampton, who can also play central midfield, 22 years of age, overall of 73, a potential of 80, a price of around 6 million. Caceres Jr. from New York Red Bulls, he can also play central midfield, 21 years of age, overall of 71, a potential of 81, a price of around 3.3 million. Ethan Ampadu from Chelsea, who can also play central midfield, 20 years of age, overall of 69, a potential of 83, but is on loan at Venezia in Season 1. Florentino from Benfica, who can also play central midfield, 21 years of age, overall of 74, a potential of 83, on loan at Getafe in Season 1. Oliver Skip from Tottenham Hotspur, who can also play central midfield, 20 years of age, overall of 76, a potential of 83, a price of around 16 million. Maxens Kakare from Lyon, who can also play central midfield, 21 years of age, overall of 78, a potential of 85, a price of around 28 million. Bubakar Kamara from Marseille, who can also play central midfield, 21 years of age, overall of 81, a potential of 86, a price of around 31 million. Career mode legend Sandro Tonali, who can also play central midfield, 21 years of age, overall of 78, a potential of 87, a price of around 36 million. But the best young central defensive midfielder in FIFA 22 career mode is England midfielder Declan Rice from West Ham. He can also play central midfield, 22 years of age, 82 overall, a potential of 87, a price of around 50 million. Moving on to the next category, which are players who have a high potential, but sadly still have a generic face in FIFA 22. And we kick off with Samu Costa from Almeria. He can also play central midfield, 20 years of age, overall of 70, a potential of 82, a price of around 3.5 million. One of my personal favourites is Lucas Gurner from San Atian. He's only 17 years of age, overall of 70, a potential of 82, a price of around 3.5 million. James Garner from Manchester United, he can also play central midfield, he's 20 years of age, overall of 69, a potential of 82, but he's on loan in Season 1. Alexandra Poulos from Panathinaikos, he can also play central midfield, 19 years of age, overall of 69, a potential of 82, a price of around 3.2 million. Alan Varela from Boca Juniors, who can also play central midfield, 20 years of age, overall of 69, a potential of 83, a price of around 3.2 million. Amadou Anana from Lille, he can also play central midfield, 19 years of age, overall of 70, a potential of 83, a price of around 3.5 million. 
Next up, a player with a much improved generic face in FIFA 22, Al Hassan Yusuf from Royal Antwerp. He can also play central midfield, 20 years of age, overall of 70, a potential of 83, a price of around 3.5 million. Mohamed Kamara from RB Salzburg, who can also play central midfield, 21 years of age, overall of 74, a potential of 83, a price of around 9 million. Kefren Taram from Nice, who can also play central midfield, 20 years of age, overall of 75, a potential of 83, a price of around 14 million. Eric Martel from RB Leipzig, he can also play as a centre back, 19 years of age, overall of 66, a potential of 84, but he's on loan in season 1. Next up, one of my favourite bargains from FIFA 21 was Daniel Ayala from Estudiantes in Argentina. He's 18 years of age, 68 overall, potential of 84, a price of only 3 million. But the highest potential central defensive midfielder in FIFA 22 without a face scan is Gustavo Asuncao from Familia Cao in Portugal. He can also play central midfield, 21 years of age, 72 overall, potential of 84, but he's on loan at Galatasaray in Season 1. Moving on to the final categories, which are cheap investments. Players with a low starting overall, so cheap to sign, but a decent potential, so he could sell for an excellent profit. Kicking off with Rassel and Dai from Sichuan, he can also play central midfield, 19 years of age, overall of 62, a potential of 80, a price of around 1 million. Leonard Hartes from Feyenoord, he can also play central midfield, 18 years of age, overall of 64, a potential of 80, a price of around 1.2 million. Javi Serrano from Atletico Madrid, he's 18 years of age, overall of 64, a potential of 80, a price of around 1.2 million. Next up, we have another decent generic face belonging to Edwin Cirillo from FC Dallas. He can also play central midfield, 20 years of age, overall of 65, a potential of 80, a price of around 1.3 million. Staying in the MLS with Andreas Pereira from Orlando City. He can also play central midfield, he's 20 years of age, overall of 65, a potential of 80, a price of around 1.5 million. Up next, we have a young player with the leadership traits that would make an excellent captain, Mansverk from Mulder. He's 19 years of age, overall of 65, a potential of 80, a price of around 1.4 million. Alexis Becker Becker from Locomotive Moscow. He can also play centre back or central midfield, 20 years of age, overall of 66, a potential of 80, a price of around 1.7 million. Alvaro Bastida from Cadiz. He can also play central midfield, he's only 17 years of age, overall of 64, a potential of 81, a price of around 1.2 million. Tomás Handel from Vitoria Guimarães in Portugal, he can also play central midfield, 20 years of age, overall of 66, a potential of 81, a price of around 1.7 million. The penultimate player in today's video is Lewis Bate from Leeds United, he can also play central midfield, 18 years of age, overall of 63, a potential of 83, a price of around 1.2 million. But definitely one of the best bargains in FIFA 22 career mode is Romeo Lavia from Manchester City. He's 17 years of age, overall of 62, a potential of 85, a price of only 1 million. So those were the best young central defensive midfielders available to sign in FIFA 22 career mode, split into three categories of real faces, high potential and cheap investments. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please remember to tune in next time, but until then, it's FCG out.